Welcome to week number six, episode number 31 of Social Distancing from Mr. Z. My name is Nathan Ziegler, the upper school principal at Hope Academy in Minneapolis. I've got this reminder over here to turn in your house tournament videos by 10 o'clock a.m. tomorrow morning, Tuesday. Turn them into the final submissions channel of your Microsoft house team. For today's magic trick, I have a box a tennis ball, a cube, and the house cup. You can see the house cup is empty. What I'm gonna do is take the cube and put it inside of the cup. You can see it in there. And I am going to take the tennis ball and put it inside of the box. Now, I'm going to make them trade places. Tennis ball over there, and the cube to the box see the cube has moved over here and the tennis ball is in the cup. Now I'm going to make them to trade back. Tennis ball over here and cube into the cup. So you can see the cube has moved back over there and the tennis ball is inside of the box. If you didn't notice, it's May 4th, so may the 4th be with you. I've got some Star Wars memes for you today. When you check your phone in the middle of the night, but forget to turn the brightness down. Hide and Seek Champion, 1983 to 2015. It's tempting, so watch out. Come to the dark side, we have masks and respirators. How BB-8 really works. <laughs> Me seeing hand soap shelves empty in stores, wondering why people haven't been washing their hands until now. May the 4th be with you. Here's the answer to last week's challenge. How many squares can you find in this figure? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Count all the triangles in this figure. 1, 2, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, the most difficult one, 23, the upside down triangle, 24, 25, 26, and 27. We're going to move back to riddles this week. The more it dries, the wetter it becomes. What is it? I bet you're wondering what Mr. Quiggle was doing over the weekend. It's quarantine with Quiggle! It's quarantine with Quiggle. Fresh. At Hope Academy, we have the most amazing seniors. I've asked them if they'd be willing to share some words of encouragement during this final month of episodes. Today's senior is Abigail Carlisle. Hope seniors, they're all really nice. Hope seniors, gonna give you advice. Hope seniors, what they say should suffice. Hope seniors, seniors. Hi you guys, I wanted to share two pieces of advice with you guys. First comes from Proverbs 3, 5-6, and it says, Trust in the Lord with all your heart and do not lean on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge Him and He will make your path straight. Pretty self-explanatory, but I want to encourage you guys that in every decision you make, big or small, to not rely on your own strength, your own understanding, even your own plans, but to rely on God, trust in Him, and trust in what He says in His Word. Second thing I want to um, share with you guys is high school goes by so fast, so fast, and I want to encourage you guys not to take these memories, these friendships for granted. They are going to last you a lifetime and over this just being stuck at home, I've realized how thankful I have been for everything I've learned over these last four years, all the things I've experienced. I wanted to say that I miss you guys. I miss my soccer team. I miss my, the student leadership team. I miss House Morris. I miss my basketball girls. I miss the teachers, I miss you all, and I'm so grateful for you all and so thankful for what an amazing impact you've all made on my life. Thank you very much, Abby. Have a wonderful week, everyone.